When we hit criminal realm together, this party started. Oh, you gonna bend it. When we coming around to get this groove going, oh, you gonna dance. Whether you're ready or not, Africa's going to make you dance. Whether you're ready or not, I said, Clarinette, I confess, I love you. Clarinette, I confess, I love you. Africa, mama. Olingo nanga ye 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 ye, Olingo umbo ya babo, no nanga ye. Are you ready now, mama? Are you ready now? Yes, I am. Say, ooh, yes, I am. You ready now? Yes, I am. Mm. Hey everybody, I'm Kumu Katalai, was born and raised in Kinshasa, the capital city of the Democratic Republic of Congo. And halfway grew up in New York City. I've made of these two places a uh, home for me. And I'm a global citizen as well. Uh, Rumbian Funk is a framework, you know, and that's why I also put to debate if I have to put my first album name Paradox or Framework, because Rumbian Funk is a framework. It's a, a sort of thinking that aligns my people on a global scale. Uh, it's a way to unifying people of African descent wherever you find them. Like, it's a unification of my people in a global scale. Because my brothers and sisters of the West, you know, they've influenced the world through jazz, through soca, zouk, compa, um, reggae, all this music are results of cultural justice. Uh, people who left Africa for a long time, but for the need of keeping their culture alive while they were under the oppression of slavery. They created their forms. They created these forms, and within this form, they preserved the African culture or the black culture in a very, very gigantic way. Rumbian funk, my style of music, everyone finds it himself. A Caribbean finds himself. Uh, Afro-Cuban find himself, uh, uh, Afro-Latino find himself, uh, African-American find himself, Africans of the motherland find themselves, and in the way of us thinking together, that's what our frame as will be on funk. So within that you see the aspect of Afro-Jazz, aspect of Afro-Caribbean, aspect of African traditional music, you see African modern twist in the city, music within the framework of Harlem street all these frames coming together and co collaborating in understanding within a framework that makes them understand each other music became also a tool now to help us elevate to elevate socially so that struggle created all the music you hear now too this the uh, Congolese version of rumba the sukus of this world, because these are what fed Africa for 70, 80 years. When you hear that sound of the guitar, like, this is what fed you, this is what made you think, I'll have my own vinyl, play my own music, I'm no longer forced to play what others deem to be socially high class, my people out there. So now, me, I am a mixture of that, I'm the global struggle. So I'm the one who now look at Afro-Cuban, I, I can see my blood floating. I look at jazz, I can see my people in it. I can see myself, and I, I can see in Caribbean, I can see my, and I can see where the all mash. Oh. That mash, that mash is called Rubian Funk. So when you're playing it, you're almost redoing what our people did in the 70s with funk. Like it united them, you know what I mean? So Rubian Funk. Go ahead, claim my path. 
clear my path. Go ahead, clear my path, my mind. Clear my path, yeah. Clear my path, oh. Chuba, ay, 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 ay